I've been getting, ever since I first streamed this, or even before, I've been getting Ames Fallout streams recommended to me constantly. But like, mostly the old ones. And, oh, it's constantly though. And sometimes I click into them. Um, and then there's this one that I clicked into and I clicked somewhere into like random random timestamp in the stream. Uh, so I didn't want to play it from the beginning because loading screen and all that, right? So I just I just pressed somewhere in the middle of it. Not not really middle, beginning ish. But and I I, ac I actually managed to find a good moment. Uh, that's not what I wanted to say, but it was a good moment before I actually managed to find the cool thing. But I, I was like uh, a little bit bamboozled because the moment I clicked into was something I had just witnessed in my Fallout stream. And it was this guy that she then, I think Thomas, that she then proceeded to follow for ages because she didn't want to kill him, but she wanted to kill him. But she wanted someone else to do it. So she was just following him for like 20 fucking minutes. <laughs> And I'm like, when is this girl gonna do something? So I was just like watching her, follow the dude and listening to the music that Ame was, you know, playing through the New Vegas radio. And just waiting, waiting for her to do it. I don't know why, why I was, normally I don't really watch VODs and all that, but like she was just capturing my soul. And then, and then she uh, had someone knock on the door. And I did not know that this was gonna be that stream. I didn't know, but... But she, she had someone knock on the door and I was like, hmm? Because then the chat's like, oh, oh, Kiara. And she's also like, ah, oh, yeah, maybe Kiara. But then she goes and then, and then nobody opens the door. And uh, she opens the door, but nobody's there. I can't, today my brain is like somewhere else. Uh, <laughs> and, and then she goes back to her table and she was like, ah, nobody was there. They ditched me. And I'm like, oh, I guess it wasn't the moment where I, you know, went into her room and saw her play Fallout. I guess it wasn't that because she came back and nobody was there, is what she says. And then I watched a little bit more and then turns out, you know, she... I realized, okay, no, but this is the time where she was in Japan and she was talking about the Japanese food. And I'm like, oh my god, this is so nostalgic. And then she talked about, yeah, it must have been Kiara because there's she has the GoXLR in her room and, they, and Kiara wants to pick it up and all that. And, and then I was like, hmm? Well then, maybe maybe it was me. Maybe it was me. And it's like I'm also watching my past self, you know. <laughs> and then and then I knock again. Apparently, past me knocks again, and Ame goes there again and opens the door. And they, and then eventually they come to Ame's PC and microphone, and uh, I hear my past self and Ame uh, talking a little bit about Fallout. Uh, and talking about how the bread has been to her, how, how it's been treating her and all that. I'm like, wow, this is like so weird. It's like I traveled back in time and I'm watching myself interact in Japan with Ame. It's, it's, it's so weird. And then I was like thinking like, oh, I'm playing Fallout now. We have come full circle. But back then when I saw Ame play Fallout and I said, oh, I want to play Fallout too. I don't really think that I meant it. I don't even know what I was thinking that game was. I don't think I knew anything. I don't think I was thinking much. I was just saying it to make conversation, I think. <laughs> and I don't think I was ever considering it playing it at the moment because I didn't really even know what she was hey playing, you know? I don't know. <laughs> it's a time paradox for real! <laughs> No, it was just kind of weird and, and funny that the one stream, because I've been ignoring so many of these stream recommendations in my YouTube recommendations, suggestions, I've been ignoring most of them, but then one of them I finally click on and it's, you know, a time paradox. <laughs> uh, I don't know, that was kind of cute. It felt like, it felt like destiny to me because I got so many Ame stream recommendations from Fallout. I ignore several of them and the one I click on is the and, and the one the timestamp also that I click on roughly turns out to be the one where I enter the stream to talk to Ame. I, it's just destiny and fate, is it not? What are the odds, man? What are the odds? That's it freaked me out, made me happy. <laughs> uh it made me a bit too excited. By the way, don't forget to hit that like button, subscribe, and hit that notification bell so you never miss a notification. <laughs>